everybody, and welcome back to Benjamin Magnus Plays Ultimate General Civil War. We left off uh, in a pretty good spot where we seem to be driving the rebel bastards from the field. Uh, we're doing pretty good moving in, uh, flanking them, taking the, the positions that we need to take. Uh, right now, I just noticed that we're being flanked by cavalry, so I'm going to have Rhino over here who I have guarding this flank. Halt and open fire. Keys is having a little trouble. Uh, you know what? Hang on. Let's send Sherman on a flankety flank flank with the first Ohio. Uh, Keys is going to wheel around and try to capture General Beauregard while Rhino continues to fire on Stewart's cavalry. Gotta love the names. General Beauregard seems to be having some trouble. Uh, Sherman might be in trouble himself, though. Ohio, turn around. No, oh, turn in the wrong way. Fuck you. Here. Uh, Franklin and Boondy need to displace over here so that these guys can form up proper like... Uh, hang on, I'm trying to get them selected. Nope, we're going to go. have to go like this. Um, yeah, right about there. He's... You having some trouble with Beauregard? Where'd he go? Ohio, I need you to fire on the 33rd Virginia Regiment. Sherman is fine. The 1st Ohio needs help, so I'll send keys down. Make sure these guys are on double quick. Bob, cover. Uh, Franklin's Regiment. Howard is going to be in trouble pretty soon. If we don't start thinning these guys out, but their skirmishers are not in a great position. Sherman, man, god damn it. What is with my... Uh, my guys in melee combat, they get into melee and they're just like, Nope! Nope! Sherman! 300 and 2800! Fuck you guys! Still... Holding on to Stuart here. He's in the river. I feel like we're missing someone in the work. There we are. Right in here. Get right on the corner. Just keep firing into him. Booty's here. Where's Midge? Midge is right there. Here, fire on the uh, 27th Virginia. They have less cover. Yes, I know everybody's exhausted. But we just need to keep... We need to keep the pressure on. And drive them from the field, gentlemen! From the field! And I feel bad. I did lose two units, basically. We took the hill. We still have uh, a few hundred men fighting in the cornfield. Here, push up keys. Push up. Yeah, it's more than a few hundred. There we go. Keep Just keep the pressure up. Uh, it took a little bit more casualties for Bob than I would like, but he did kill nearly a thousand men. Keys. Fire! Confederate, whoa! Our men are exhausted from the continuous fight, and more rebels are coming in. We should defend our position and not advance further. Well, I'm on the edge of the map. Fuck! Pause. 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 Uh, the first Ohio is just super boned. So what? Sherman, Wilcox, and the second New York. I need you guys to form up right there. Hang on. And what we need to do here is move everybody. All right. Sorry. There was just a delivery guy at my door. All right. So this is going to... Oh, poor Ohio. But if Sherman can hold them while we try to cross... While they try to get across the river. Uh, here. Let's just have you halt and move here. Wilcox, I need you over on this side. Well, actually, just right there is fine because the New York is moving over this way. They're going to get stuck crossing the river, so hopefully we can hold them off. Keys is not in a great position. Sherman, just keep firing. Keep firing at Cook. Coke? Cook? Cock? The second New York will come up this way. We got Rhino. Here, Rhino, do me a favor. Cross the river. Get into the trees. Supplies up this way. This one needs to go back here. Yeah, these guys are not in a good position. Oh, wow. They were just right up in there, weren't they? Franklin. 
Form up and fire. Sherman's routing again. My god, dude. What is up with you? I'm just I'm having I seem to have a lot of trouble getting people into position. Sherman's routing routed from the field. Rhino. Oh god, they are Jesus Christ, you see these guys fucking charge? I feel like we're not doing very well now. Their reinforcements are a son of a bitch. Howard, halt. Open fire on any rebels that are in... Oh, God, where'd these guys come from? Oh, Bob! Oh, Bob! Oh, God, no! No, not Bob! Those guys are expensive! I didn't know they had more reinforcements coming from this side. Fuck! The second New York is uh, fled... Wilcox is getting flanked. Fall back. Rhino. You took that position, but then it turned out to be pretty useless. Sherman, what were you... I don't know why Sherman is such a pussy. Bob, oh, poor Bob. He's... D oh, look at the casualties. This is hideous. Fire on Bartlow. Fire on Bartlow. Fire on Bartlow. Oh, where are all you guys going? Where are you going? Oh, the battle's this way. Man, the Confederates are so much better in melee than I am. Like, we get into melee combat, and my gut, my lines just crumble. Got all these cannons up here. Here, just fire into that. Oh, God. Bob just got slaughtered. We drove them off, but poor fucking Bob. Lewark's in melee combat. Howard, you need to fire on B. This is just a mess of troops right here. Halt. Just fire into anybody you can get your fucking a, a bead on. Look at this. This is a mess. The supplies get up here. Wilcox. Keys is in melee combat. Sherman's re retreating again. Halt. Halt. Hold the line. Hold the line. Franklin, oh man, Bob just, Bob got wrecked. Midge is still up. I've taken, I've taken a lot of casualties here. Keys is in retreat again. Halt, halt, hold that position, hold that position. And they're charging again. Confederate charges are brutal, Bob. All my artillery to open fire. Second Ohio. Wilcox. Move back into position. All my officers are wounded. Maybe that's some, some of the issue I've had. A lot of my officers are wounded. Johnson. Fire on Johnson. Lewark, move back up. Well, I think we're okay. People fled. Broke. Ran. And then we, we, we reformed. We got the artillery back. Whoa, we've taken heavy casualties, though. Heavy. Poor Bob. 80% casualties. Well, not that high, but still high. Keys. These large... Uh, their morale must be low because these large ones tend to just crack, hold, crack, and break. Oh, we got a melee again. Franklin. We're just firing shot into the melee. 
Mid just firing into it. Bob, move up this way. Franken looks like he's in retreat. Franklin's in retreat again. Halt. No, no, not route. Did I hit route? Is that a button? Keys over this way for me. Wilcox, Jesus Christ, dude, you are killing me. These large ones uh, seem to be rather useless. Um, here, let's move up this way. Ammo, move up with the troops, please. I don't know why their morale is so low. Maybe because I bet I bet you anything, their morale's low when their uh, officers die. But you're gonna cross the river and flank this motherfucker. Howard, move up. Franklin, fire, Midge, fire, Bob, fire. Everybody, just shoot this guy. Alright, one of theirs just route right up to the edge of the field for me. I know you're exhausted. I know you're exhausted. There's not much left. There's not much left. Just a little bit longer, guys. I believe in you. The reinforcements on this end really threw me for a loop. I did not see that coming. Midge is running low on ammo. He's out. I think you when you run out of ammo, your reload just tanks is what happens. Right. Turn around and open fire on Holmes. Lewark, turn back, open fire on Smith. Howard, to the embankment here. Keys, reload. Open fire. Open fire. Ooh, man, I lost a lot of men. A lot of men. I'm going to have to pay a lot of money for reinforcements. Into homes. Into homes. Yeah. Route him. Route him from the field. All right. They're routed too. Guys, move up out of the field to form a line. Move up. Keep firing into these guys that are retreating. This the, the the river here with this bend in the river. It's just a bloodbath. Halt. Yes, I know you're exhausted. You don't have to keep telling me. I know, gentlemen. Just a little bit longer. Uh, let's see. No, more like this. Across the river, back across. I think we got these guys. I think we got these damn rebel bastards on the run. A little bummed some of these larger units cracked and broke and ran from the melee. I gotta, I gotta remember that for the future. Avoid melee combat with rebel soldiers. Or maybe try to outfit them with... Uh, with weapons with better better melee stats. So I've got this hill. Um, I don't technically hold that one, I don't think. Can Ben take it? Wilcox is running. Just keep shooting him. All right, let's speed this motherfucker up now. Oh my god, those reinforcements. I thought I had them on the goddamn run, and then those reinforcements showed up. Ooh. I don't see anybody else on the field. And it looks like they're running. Here we go. Here's somebody. Here, you shoot there. You guys shoot there. And hang on. Cannons. Fire. Reserves. Move up. Fire at Holmes. See if we can wipe him. 
Route them from the field. Second New York. Alright, yeah, they're 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 running. We got them on the run, boys. We got them on the run. We got this. Right up into this little field here. And looks like, hang on, let's give it a pause. There's still someone over here. Let's march up and shoot them. Midge, Lawark, and Boondi, everybody's just going in now. Yeah, I'm not too worried about that one. Little sad we've lost that that I'm I'm very very um sad that three regiments of three brigades of mine were almost completely wiped from the field. Do we have to complete do we just time out and chase them from the field or what do we do? Keep shooting them. Route them. Still working on this regiment over here. Brigade. Oh, poor Bob. Kills deaths. He still managed to outkill his opponents. Still, still on the battlefield. All right, let's go get him. I think we just have to wait this out. And hands up, hands up away from the keyboard. You can finish the mission or we'll just finish it. I think we're good. Woo, victory, the first battle of, Vic of Bull Run. So we had more troops. They had that, they had the fucking jump on me. Oh boy. Wounded. A couple of people got promoted. Two people were wounded. Managed to capture a couple. A couple, uh. couple guns. Not, not anything too terribly. Too terribly interesting. But look at the, uh. the points we got from that. Woo! Oh. 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 So yeah, those guys. Roach, oh god, Roach and Camden wiped from the field, gone forever. Uh, I'm gonna do my career points first. And I think medicine will be good. Yeah, let's put them into that. So let's apply that. Uh, first things first, get this back up to where we like it, a thousand. I mean, we can make them, we can make them huge. Actually, we can, we can bring these right up to 1500. Here, let's bring Midge up to fifth. No, Midge, fifteen hundred. Uh, I hit cancel, apply. Uh, Boondi, very pricey to bring you all the way back up to a thousand. Apply that. Uh, we lost two guns. It looks like. No, no, we had we had we had the, we had eight before. We have better guns. This is a ten pounder. Hmm, howitzer Napoleon. 10-pound ordinance, the 10-pound parrot gun. Effective range, 1,700. 1,500. So, it's a little slower on the reload, but more efficient, more damage. I could do... I got tw I got, I got eight 24-pound howitzers. Reload way down, damage way up. What's the range on these? Range is, is down, 20 pound, five, I can do five 20 pound parrot guns. About the, what about the Napoleons? 
Reload down, efficiency down, damage way up. Six pound field guns. Very weak in long range fire. Oh, the 10 pound parrot I like the sound of. But not for short range defense. This is just a standard. Hmm. What these big guns would be brutal up close. The reload's awful. Kind of like the idea of these howitzers. 24 pound howitzers. Yeah, why don't we go ahead and do that? Let's equip, we spend the money, equip them with the howitzers. We gotta, get, we definitely gotta fix these guys up. I'm gonna, I wanna, you know what, I feel like these, the larger units are definitely worth it. Uh, we need a new leader here. Let's go ahead. Yes, sir. Ooh, and we get to pick a promotion. Discipline training, morale and efficiency, or stamina, efficiency, and speed. I'm gonna do this one. Whew! That was rough. Now, Bob's got the Lorenz rifle. Do we have enough? We got Palmetto 1842s. Which are just a little bit better in melee. We got, the Lore we got a lot of Lorenz. Uh, we got the Springfield model 1855. Which has that longer range, but it's worse in melee. But a higher re reload. What's the Harper's Ferry? Harper's Ferry looks like it's basically the same thing as this, just a little bit better. It cost fifty thousand dollars to uh, equip Midge's Brigade with the Harper's Ferry rifle. Higher range, higher rate of fire, similar damage, and that's pricey. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. What we really need is we need to bring back the fucking skirmishers. God damn it. I'm sorry, Roach. Well, here. Let's cancel this. Uh, go skirmishers. And let's see what we what can we equip them with. Is that a sniper rifle? That is a sniper rifle with a scope. I can equip 100 men with sniper rifles. Low damage, high accuracy, and huge effective range. So if I do a hundred men, I can give them. I, we can go the other direction. We can give them those sniper rifles. So they got sniper rifles now. That's cool. And my poor cavalry. I spent a lot of money on them, and they got wrecked. So we're gonna recreate this. Should we just go whole hog on cavalry? 500 men, $20,000. Huge cavalry. Alright. I They were very effective, but, oh, unfortunately, that that legion that we were facing before, whatever it was called, that thing was brutal. They kept popping up out of nowhere and slaughtering me. Um, I can increase the side of, of, of Bob. Bob's uh, regiment here. Let's go ahead and do that. 1,500 men. Increase our supplies we get from the government. We could request more 24 pound howitzers. More money. Yeah, let's go ahead and spend that. Order those. Uh, that should allow us to increase the size here to 12, I believe. We're going to do that. 12 24 pound howitzers is our artillery. And I feel like another, skirmi uh, another skirmisher brigade would do the trick. So. What do we got in terms of rifles? Sharps rifle. That's pretty standard weapon choice for sharpshooter regiments. 450 range. Smith has, yeah. Sharps model 1855. Think of the sharps rifle. We do 300. 300 with sharps rifles. Let me do more than that. We do 400. Okay. Okay, and uh, I am sorry for the people Camden, Camden and Roach lost on the first goddamn battle. Whew, sorry guys. So, battle map. Oh, we got three to choose from now. 
We've got a river crossing, a crossroads, and then the Battle of Shiloh. So let's see, what do we got here? Um, river crossing. A portion of your army advances uh, to West Virginia to strengthen Lincoln's interest in the area, but rebel guard the river passage that you must cross. Advance and defeat the rebels that block your path, securing one of the two hills ahead of you. Uh, we'll convince them to abandon it. The rebels uh, have strengthened presence at Cumberland Gap, a strategic position near the junct junction of Kentucky, Virginia, and Tennessee states. They recently made Mill Springs their winter quarters, and this position is our next military target. Uh, detachments of the Army of Ohio... I've already been dispatched and will gather at uh, Logan's Crossroads to commence their assault. The mission is to protect Logan's Crossroads until all of your troops arrive. This is a defensive. This is, I think this is offensive and this is defensive. I'm going to try the, I'd rather do this one, I think. Okay. So, that's my, that's my core. A uh, uh, portion of your troops must advance to West Virginian soil to support Lincoln's interest in the area. Narrow River uh, Passage must be crossed in order to reach our destination on time. Okay, this is where they're going to be defending. However, our pickets report enemy presence on the hill ahead of us. It seems that the rebels are seeking to confront us. Probably some Confederates right on the hill to control the junction. Certain that the rebels will be ill-supplied and not capable of for a prolonged fight. Okay, so they, they have these two hills. General, your vanguard must scout ahead and clear the path for our army. Holding at least one of these two hills will certainly convince the rebels to withdraw. So i got to take a hill. Very nice. But uh, we are just about out of time, so I'm going to leave this right here. Thanks for watching, everybody. Don't forget to drop a like, leave those comments right down below. And if you're interested in more Benjamin Magnus plays Ultimate Generals of the War, just subscribe to this channel, and I'll see you next time.